So welcome back. And as I said, I'm here with Priscilla, who is a vegetarian. And we're going to show you, and I'm going to show Priscilla also, a um, little vegetarian snack, and we're going to make it into a meal. Um, so Priscilla, how long have you been a vegetarian? About 30 years. Wow. And, um, uh, I, I love vegetables. I love fruits. But I'm pretty certain I don't good, put good meals together. I mean, I kind of grab something here and there. I'm really uh, quite busy. I don't cook meals. Um, and I, and I, I'm certain I don't get enough protein because I don't eat fish. I don't eat dairy. Oh. Uh, I do eat eggs, but um, uh, no cheese, no dairy, no fish, meat, chicken, anything like that. So. I would love to find a way to get some protein in my meals that is still quick to do and uh, isn't any of those non-vegetarian non things. Right. Absolutely. I, absolutely. Um, this is what I found with vegetarians on how to combine um, protein to make to combine foods, foods uh, to combine foods to make a complete protein. A complete protein, which is in eggs, chicken, turkey, fish. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so, to start, everything here is organic, which okay. I'm very fixed on organic. Mm -hmm. um, we have some, this is sprouted grain bread, and I know a lot of people go with whole wheat, whole grain. Sprouted grain bread is, it's, it's sprouted, it's not bleached, it's not processed, there's nothing artificially added to it. Is it flour and yeast, or it's it's actually made from the the grain? grains, oh, the grains? Okay. Okay. Yes, oh, it yes. Looks delicious. You can probably find it in the frozen food section. Um, I've seen it in grocery stores, health food stores. Okay. So, so it's does it have to stay frozen? Yes. Okay. I would say. Okay. Because it, because it, I mean, you can keep it in the refrigerator. They say keep it frozen. Some people keep it in the refrigerator. If you're going to eat it every day. I would right, say refrigerator, right. but not. it's not processed. It's so not it processed, okay. so it's, it, oh, it, it'll go bad fast. Okay, good. I would say to be on the safe side, keep it in the freezer. Um, and here we have some fresh organic almond butter. This stuff is, I love this stuff. Almond butter. Oh, it's almond butter. Um, I use almond butter um, in place of peanut butter. Everybody's on peanut butter kick. Um, what we don't know a lot of times about oils, if if we don't keep them cold, the oils go rancid if it gets heated up. It doesn't sound very appetizing. No, <laughs> and, and um, that's with any nut seeds, oils. Um, peanuts go rancid very fast, the oils in the peanuts. Okay. So I use the almond butter, and I think it has a sweeter taste. It's, it's got more essential fatty acids. Okay. I, 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 I think it tastes Isn't better. Isn't really high calorie? Yes, it is. But when you feed your body nutrient-dense foods, raw foods, as, as we have here as we go along, and I'll explain um, what these are, um, with the enzymes intact, mm -hmm. when you're eating it and digesting it, your body's assimilating all the nutrients. And when you're, when you're getting nutrient-dense food without all the process and all the right. sugars and artificial ingredients, your body will process it, take it in as food, and give your body energy. It fuels your body as energy. So, this so is you're good. burning the calories. Oh, I see. Okay. Did you All ever right. notice if yeah. you eat something processed, a donut, a cookie that's sugar and processed um, with wheat and flour or, or, or whatever, that, um, it, it raises your blood sugar levels and then you crash afterwards. Yeah. So it's not a continuous. Right, it's like right. feeding a car good gasoline. It, it runs. Right, you know? right. Okay. Okay, good. Oh, so, so this looks good. So what are we making? <laughs> this is kind of odd. But um, so when we mix a nut butter with a whole grain, or like this is a sprouted grain, um, it makes a complete protein because nuts and seeds, um, they do have protein in them, and so does whole grain sprouted grain bread. I love almond butter, so I'm just loading <laughs> this on here. Um, and that makes a complete, when you mix them together, it makes a complete protein. So that it, it's complete because there's sprouted grain in the bread and the nuts. So the nut is a protein and the sprouted grain is a protein, but mixed together they make a complete, complete protein. Complete protein. Which is the same that your body would be getting if, if I was taking in meat or... or right, chicken, turkey, fish. Okay. Oh, okay. Any yeah. eggs you take in. It looks but much this more appetizing to me. Here. This is great, actually. Um, 
these right here, they're raw organic cacao nibs. The nib, um, they're actually raw chocolate. Pure. Really? Nothing raw chocolate. Can I taste one? Absolutely. Oh, it's crunchy. Yeah, it's bitter. That's, when oh, you put but it, I, I prefer dark chocolate to, to sweet chocolate. So it's that, actually, actually very like good. That. You know what? Mm -hmm. Wow. Raw, um, this is dark chocolate. It's raw organic. It has no sh added sugar. Um, it's the bean. It's the real cocoa wow. bean filled mm -hmm. with antioxidants. So this is actually And good it's for you. actually a good fat also. Wow. Same with the almond butter. Good fats. It's no artificial ingredients. Your body's going to take it on, assimilate it as food, and give your body energy. Your body's going to function more efficiently. Nice. So this is kind of like a little snack that um, I've created here. The almond butter with the cacao nibs. See, this is my kind of thing. It's fast. Yeah. I can pull a piece of bread out, put on some of the almond butter, sprinkle some of those on, and, and right, I have a complete right. protein. Absolutely. And healthy fats and actually something nutritious. And you have a little crunch there. I love it. Nutritious. It looks great. You're getting your fiber, your essential fats, you're getting antioxidants, magnesium. Wow, beautiful. It's actually very good. Good. Now, we can take this. Okay, that's a great little snack. Now, you can take this. Excuse us here. And you can put vegetables to it. Your greens, which you need. You need your greens. Mm -hmm. um, so here are some alfalfa sprouts. I'm going to spread these on a little bit. It's good when it's messy. Some organic greens. Now, this is not iceberg lettuce. I no, it's that. not. It's organic. It's, they're all baby greens, all organic. Um, right there. You can buy that mix in the market? You can buy it in the market, supermarket, health okay. food store. It's, it's, a lot, it's around now in, okay. in a lot of the supermarkets. Um, this is actually, these are those long seedless cucumbers. I slice them very thin. Cucumbers are very cleansing. I like the crunch on the cucumbers. And here we have, again, a red. I like red peppers. I don't like the taste of green ones. These are organic red peppers. Very Sliced colorful. Very thin. I love color. Color and texture and, you know, it's got crunch to it. It's got the creaminess of the almond butter. Mm. I, you know, it's, it's fulfilling. It's a fulfilling meal it looks and delicious. it's healthy it's not something I would naturally put together but but it looks really delicious it I mean good. it wouldn't have occurred to me to put almond butter cacao nibs sprouts and and greens and peppers on absolutely that. and it's a great combination it's a great combination you're getting your protein your fiber your um, your good fats some flavor some crunch wow. would you like to taste it I would love to okay Really good. You can, and if you put this on toast, oh my God, the almond butter just like oozes <laughs> out of it from the heat. You share with me? Absolutely. There Here we go. go. Great. Thank you so there much. Cheers. Yeah, this is what it looks like. It's good. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Mmm. It's not bad. Oh no, it's great. The red peppers are sweet, the cucumbers are crunchy, the cacao nibs are a little bitter. <laughs> I love it. That's great. Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome, Priscilla. So I'm gonna take this with me. You can take it. <laughs> you can take it. I have enough here. Again, thank I you thank so you much. so much. I'm gonna give you, you a hug. It. Thank you for joining us on Body Scope by Karen, Fitness from the Inside Out. See you next time. <laughs>